Welcome to the smooth life. Grab a Tropica, sit back and enjoy. Tropica, nothing smoother. In the previous episode of Tropica Island of Treasure All-Stars, our celeb contestants chose their new partners. Roxy swapped partners with Carlin using a long-life charm advantage. And Surya and Liardas became the first smooth fan team on Tropica Island of Treasure. The newly formed teams competed in their first challenge as duos. And at the long life ceremony, Team Sashi stole three points from Team Surya, sending them into the first elimination challenge of the season, alongside Team Kanya, Team Ney and Team Maurice. Then in a grueling game of memory and endurance, it came down to the placement of one bead, which made Team Kanya hang their buffs on the elimination pineapple. Now the points are back to zero, and it's anyone's game once again. going home was really sad. I yeah. know that she wanted to go all the way. She yeah. was amped, she was pumped, as well as Dane. She had a great partner. Yeah. So it's just quite sad to see them go. It's horrible when anyone leaves. Yeah. Um, especially yeah, such a big nice. personality, such a bubbly personality, lovely person. So yeah, and it's not going to get any easier as we go on. Yeah. Eight duos remain in the competition and there are only seven flavors to earn which means they'll have to give it everything they've got to earn a spot on the island. But with another long life ceremony on the cards, it's all about how they play their smooth strategy. Welcome to Tropica Island of Treasure All-Stars. Well, we deserve to go to the Seychelles. We constantly work together, we work hard. I can see the passion in our eyes. We will push. We will push. I want this very badly. I want the <laughs> flavor very badly. I want to be part of that top seven. We're going all the way. I want a flavor, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, walking on the beach and I see the scoreboard and we all start all over. Mm -hmm. And that makes me feel really, really happy. Another opportunity, as I was saying now. Yes, yes. Yeah. Welcome to Ingwe Beach in St. Lucia. This long, sandy stretch of coastline is a renowned fishing spot. From here, you can clearly see the magnificent Mapelane Dune, which is the tallest vegetated dune in South Africa and second tallest in the world. Now, some of you had quite the dune to climb in the last elimination challenge. Liardis, how are your calves feeling? <laughs> it's not my calves that's burning, it's my lower back. <laughs> it's your lower back. Yeah, that was quite intense. Yeah. Ney, that was quite a tough one. How do you feel? I feel good. It was tough. You know, you felt it on the hamstrings. Mm. But I woke up fresh today. Well, it's a new dawn and a fresh leaderboard. After every elimination round, your scores will be set back to zero and we start from scratch. But this time, you're fighting for more than just points. You're fighting for your trip to the Seychelles. Only seven teams will be heading to the island. So, you want to do your best to stay out of elimination. I want to go to the Seychelles so bad. And we keep the twists coming. On Tropica Island of Treasure, there's always room for something new. And so, I'd like to introduce you to what we call squad games. Hey. Right? Come on. Yeah. Woo. For this next challenge, you'll be split into two squads with four duos each. In this bag are eight Tropica bottles. Six of them are pineapple. One is cool red and one is orange flavored. If you pick the cool red, you will go first. If you pick the orange, you will go second. From there, you will pick your squad, schoolyard style. I'm worried about my endurance today and any physical kind of challenge. I'm super excited for squad games. Um, I'm looking forward to actually pairing with everyone, especially mm. after all the drama. Maurice. Yeah. Come have a pick, man. Okay, that's me. Please make sure you look away. I'll go away, brother. Pow. Perfect. Pow, pow, pow. <laughs> but, uh... Oh! The moment I have a red bottle in my hand, I feel pressure. 
Maurice gets to pick first right off the bat. Well done. Yeah. 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 Sashi? Mm -hmm. uh, Do not look in the bag. Mm -hmm. oh. Pineapple. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. So there are three pineapples left. That orange is in there somewhere. <laughs> shake it shake, shake. Brendan? One pineapple left and one orange left. Alyssa, come pick. gets to pick second. Well, which leaves a pineapple for Team Jono. Jono, can you collect? I hope it's nothing with strength. Right, on to the game. We will be playing an egg and spoon game. Only this one is not the one you were used to as a kid. It's a little bit trickier. Each team will start with a giant wooden spoon with eight handles. Some handles are shorter and trickier to grip than others. Instead of an egg, you will carry a calabash filled with a Tropica bottles. Together as a squad, you will carry this through the obstacle course. At the first hurdle, together as a team, you will go over the top, then underneath, and then at the third hurdle, on top again. And then it's a race, to the finish line, where you will place the calabash onto the podium. You will then go back through the course to the beginning and get a second calabash with Tropicas and do the course again. The first team to place two calabashes on the podium wins. But there is a catch. At the starting line, there are three calabashes. Two of them need to end up on the podium, so you only have one backup. If you drop the calabash or the wooden spoon it touches the sand, you have to go back to the beginning. You may not pick up the calabash you dropped, you have to go get the one at the starting line. You only have one try to restart, so if you fail a second time, you're eliminated from the challenge. Each duo in the winning squad will get four points, and each duo in the losing squad will get only one point. But there is a catch. In the middle of the course, there is a long life charm. At any point, as an individual or as a duo, you may abandon your team. <laughs> wow, <laughs> individual. To attempt to go get the long life charm. To get the charm, you must solve a mathematical riddle where four digits will unlock the padlock and release your charm. Remember, you only have one attempt. So if you don't get it right, it's done for you. For the Long Life's Charm, there are only four stations. So be quick or you miss out. Or do it for your team. The choice is yours. All smooth? Smooth. Right, let's pick squads and get started. Team Maurice, to your right. Team Roxy, to your left. I'm thinking Team Jonathan, mm -hmm. Team Jonathan and definitely Team Shuri. <laughs> Hopefully we'll be like one of the first teams that gets picked. Yeah. We don't want to be like <laughs> the last, <laughs> the, last <laughs> the leftovers. Maurice, you chose Cool Red, you get to pick first. Okay, <laughs> this is so difficult. Um, uh, okay, we call on Brendan. Team Brendan on the Cool Red team. Team Roxy, your turn to pick. We're going to balance out the size, so we're going with Jonathan. Before Maurice is about to pick, uh, I signaled to him that he must take Brendan, because he wanted to take me, obviously, because of our you know, alliance and brotherhood and whatever. Backfires, uh, Roxy does pick me, so now it's like... Team Nay. Team Nay. So Maurice picks Brendan, and then we think, OK, he's going to probably pick another tough guy. Next mm. thing he says, Team Nay, and we're like, what? Mm. Obviously, he's got Brendan, strong guy. He's got us, strong team. Um, Liardus and Shreya. 
Die hart is een show, ja. My hartse punt. Hey. Karlienke. Ja, maar. Team Karlienke of Team Marks. Team Sashi. Hey. Team Marks. Are you happy? Hey. All smooth. 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 Let's play the game. Yeah. Yeah. The other team is very physical, but uh, it's all about strategy from now. Right, smooth squads. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Lift your wooden spoons and find your balance. Slowly. Uh, up. Up, up. Slowly. Slowly at the, at the back. Back. Stop. Up. On my whistle. Slowly, slowly, stay set pace. Just communicate slowly. And there both teams off to a slow start. Finding their balance. Team Cool Red looks like they are ahead. Yeah, can we go a little bit faster? I'm out of breath already, eh? A <laughs> little bit faster, a little bit faster, a little bit faster. Team Orange. Well done, guys. Slower. Well done, well done, guys. Hurdle coming up. Both squads passing straight by the long life charm. Dude, my mind is not anywhere near any charm. My mind is trying to survive. These wooden spoons must be, especially with the tropicas on top. <laughs> They've reached the first hurdles, both teams. Tropic time, you're going to have to carry on, eh? Orange going over the first hurdle. That spoon is really heavy. <laughs> Even the strongest of us complaining. Yeah. Team Orange off to a good start. Team Cool Red. This thing's heavy. As the challenge unfolds, keep your eyes open for three Golden Tropica bottles, just like this one. Let us know where you spot them using hashtag Tropica on socials and stand a chance to win smooth prizes. This one counts, so find two more. Come, guys. That's come, on, come, on, come on, come on, come on. All over, team. Okay, relax, relax, relax. Cool Red are over the beam. Team Orange ahead. It looks like Orange has taken the lead. Ruan, is your time to help, though. Ruan, you have to talk to yourself. We are not focusing on the other squad. We are focusing on getting this hot on this target. That is all we are focusing on. Yes, you're in way too much pain to focus on the other squad, to be honest. <laughs> Sit back. Slowly, guys. Team Orange. Go over, go over. Nice, 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 nice. Relax, relax. Over the third hurdle. Slowly. Team Cool Red. Also going over the third hurdle. Who do you think will abandon their squad and go for the long life charm? Let us know on socials using hashtag Tropica. And then I need to go back. Karlin going to help Ruan and she's now back by her handle. Both teams are now neck and neck. I'm a bit wait, I'm a bit wait, 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 wait. Press at the back. No, Orange have placed their first calabash on the podium. Now they must go back to where they came and start again. We've got the first calabash up. Feels good. Cool Red have got their first calabash on the podium. The most difficult part is to keep that spoon together as a team. The podium. And I'm moving back across the obstacle course, right to the beginning. Let's go, let's go. Okay. Run, go this side. Run, come this side. Down it all, guys. Relax. Can we can do it. Team Orange almost at the starting line. So far, so good. I can see some tired arms. We were in such a rhythm on the second yeah. one already, hey? Yeah. And it just felt so much better. Everyone was breathing, everyone was focused. Um, it got really, really tough for the guys in the front. Mm. Both squads are really communicating well here. Everything is going good so far. And Team Orange is already moving for the second time. Squad Cool Red, slowly behind. Both squads passing right by the long life charm again. 
Guys, are you sure you want to do this? Genuinely, I'm thinking let us drop the spoon and go for the charm. That's it. <laughs> wow, wow. Can you drop me? Team Orange going over their first hurdle. Everything looks good. Uh, down at the bottom. We are just going to the front. Go, go, go. It's not feeling too heavy at this point, yeah. but the back's starting to feel it. And then up that hill, we fly. Yeah, that is quick. That's funny that we're worried about the hill. Team Cool Red, Ruan looks like he's struggling a lot there. Ruan is dying right now. And Maurice is asking, um, Ruan, are you okay? Can anyone help me? <laughs> Can anyone switch with me, please? He was very flustered by the Yo. team next to us going ahead of us. In the back, come on back, come on back. There we go. Will Cool Red catch up to Orange and take the victory? Let us know using hashtag Tropica on social. Team Orange leading this about to go under their second hurdle. No, you can't, just one person. Let's go. Team Orange going over the third hurdle, but it seems there's a hiccup. Cool Red about to go under the second hurdle. Team Orange have gone over the third hurdle. When the spoon started being um, becoming but unbalanced, there was a bit more pressure on the ones on the front. Team Orange have got the head of the spoon over. Jonathan grabs the pot and it's up the podium! Yeah! Yes, guys! <laughs> Yeah, neck and neck. <laughs> Orange squad, you win the challenge. Well, you get four points. Well <laughs> cool nice red work. squad. Nice work. Nice Unfortunately, you lost the challenge, and you will each be getting nice one work. point. <laughs> Seeing Jonathan put up that last calabash, it's not a good feeling, but we gave it our all. I'm just happy to be done putting that thing down. Yo. What a feeling, that was eh? amazing, eh? I was, was so glad. Like slow motion. Yes. Well done to the Orange squad. Each duo in your squad will be receiving four points, while each duo in the Cool Red squad will only be receiving one. But to those of you at the bottom, do not fret. There's still another challenge, after which we will be entering the Long Life Ceremony, where each team will be given one point to gift to another. So keep your smooth strategy in mind. Speaking of strategy, no one went for the long life charm. Hmm, interesting. Jono, can you tell me why that is? Uh, it was all about teamwork. There was a lot of debate, um, but from the beginning we were all, all pretty much in agreement that no one's going to leave the team stranded. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Kathleen, do you have a reason? Same. <laughs> Wow, look at you guys playing a happy family. <laughs> well, you guys do know that only one duo can walk away with a smooth million, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah later, later. Oh, later. Yeah, later. <laughs> Come back. He's going to be stronger than I said, back. Way stronger. Not feeling too great. We wanted to win and pull this through, but I think at the end of the day, it's about great teamwork and ups for the, for the other team. Mm -hmm. They really brought it today. Well, after all of that, let's get into the game and let's have some flipping fun. <laughs> I just really hope it's nothing physical because I'm not sure I could cope with it right now. For the next challenge, you will be competing as your duos again. Right, finally, I'm sure you guys are all relieved, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Great. At your starting block, each team will get a set of flippers and fins. First thing you'll need to do is get kitted up. Then on the table, there are three different sized balls and a bottle of Tropica. Each member of a team will only use one flipper and you may only use the outside of the flipper to carry the ball and the Tropica to the end of the course where you will see a basket and that's where you will put the ball and the Tropica in. The first team to complete the challenge will receive six points. The next two will receive five. The two after that will receive four, then three, then two, and finally, the duo that completes the challenge last will only receive one. All smooth? Smooth! 
Let's play. Remember, your ticket to the Seychelles is what's at stake. Unless you want to stay here. <laughs> <laughs> Put on your fins and flippers. Let's get this game going. This doesn't look like a fun jelly to me. I don't know. It looks so fun and funny to me. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to try and enjoy this. We're in good spirits because yeah. of how the previous challenge went. Um, this looks fun. Yeah. This is not for me. This is not for us. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but we try and stick positive. Maybe, yes. maybe we're great at this. I've never wall flippers for this reason. Right. Duos, are you ready? Yes. 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 Right. On my whistle. In the middle, centre. You want this cover? Let's go. Okay, let's go. Got it. Got it. Team Nay off with a flying start. Slowly. The best way to place the objects would be to use In the, the centre. centre. And then our movement is if coordinated. I, if coordinated. If I do left, she steps on left. If we do right, she does on right. And Team Nay with the first ball in. Team Roxy with their first ball. Going for the hardest ball first. Mm, the volleyball. The middle ball, mm. and then the big one, and then the bottle, and then the small ball last. Just to get the feel of it. Yeah. Mm. Team Maurice with their first ball. <laughs> Team Kathleen got one in. These penguin wings are not our <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, these flippers, they suck. There's a reason penguins don't play cricket out. <laughs> team Roxy have their second ball. Most of the teams have started with the bigger balls, but I see Team Brendan is starting with the smaller one. The strategy of um, choosing the small balls first and then the bigger ball it last, worked. it worked, it, it did. Team Jonathan looking like a well-oiled machine. What, what sound does a penguin make? Quick, 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 quick. Team Sashi choosing to walk backwards. It feels great. Yay! Absolutely. Yeah, I loved it. I found the soccer ball really hard because um, it kind of floated its way down. Um, and then we were like, oh, I just felt like it was going to fall. But we managed just to get over that hurdle and we could sprint back down to get the next one. Team Roxy have their second ball. Finally, Team Brendan with the small ball in. But which one will they go with next? Okay. Go. Team Nay is really struggling with that small ball. Roxy and Alyssa walking sideways, but towards the basket. Team Brendan also doing a good job. Kathleen and Rowan choosing to go backwards. So as we grip on it, it's a bit tricky, but now that we're pressing Keeping on that other, pressure. now we have it, and now we go. Team Carlene have got two. Why? Team Maurice are having a tough time with that Tropica. Our, our focus is to finish it, and yeah. finish first, of course. That's our only focus, not what's happening next to us. Mm. Which team do you think has the best flipper strategy? Let us know using hashtag Tropica on socials. Hey, who thought it could run in flippers? A lot harder to maneuver those balls yeah. than we thought. We saw flames. Team Ney is really struggling with that small ball. <laughs> Alyssa and Roxy on their oh, final gosh. ball. Roxy and Alyssa flying. And no, no, no. Well, Roxy and Alyssa are the first to get all of their odd objects into the basket. And Team Roxy, we done. Anga, Anga, it's us. <laughs> Nay and Jay on their final ball. Team Brendan on their final ball. Team Jono on their final ball. And Team Nay are finished. After a great start, Team Brendan in third. Yes! We made it! <laughs> we made it. Feels good to be second. Yes. Even though first would have been better, but feels good that we are at the top. Top three was the goal, and we yes. got it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Team Carlene in fourth place. Team Jonathan is really struggling with that small ball. It's turning out to be a lot harder. Yes. 
Team Sashi, Sashi, you've got to use the outside. This is the toughest one, definitely. Yeah, I keep sliding off. The side. Okay, go, go, go. Lift up, lift up. Team Jonathan in fifth place. There we go, we're done. Team Sashi in sixth place, just behind Team Jonathan. Shreya and Liardis with just the Tropica bottle left. Come on, Team Maurice, let's go. Team Shreya and Team Maurice struggling to finish. We're just pushing to not be lost. We need those two points. We are just trying to get to the end and get this Tropica in this basket. Team Shreya moving but struggling. We're losing time actually with a small ball because mm. it fell off the table. Mm. Let's go, Team Maurice! Anything can happen! Wait, here we go. Three and the artists slowly approaching their basket with their Tropica bottle. And Team Shreya coming seven. Let's go, Team Maurice! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Here we go, there we go, there we go! Let's go, Team Maurice! Team Maurice finally getting it right! You know, we're not giving up. Mm. What we start, we finish. Not stopping when we tire, yeah. but stopping Doesn't when we... Doesn't matter where you end. Finish what you start. And they get it in! And coming in last place is Team Maurice. Well done, everybody. Team Maurice finishing in last place, and we'll only be getting one point. Will that be enough to avoid elimination? Let us know what you think using the hashtag Tropica on socials. So guys, use your time now to strategize because the next time I see you will be the long life ceremony. Another long life ceremony, oh. How do you guys feel? Top of the leaderboard? All like up in the air right now. But well done. No, he was so fast. So yeah, you have to decide now who you want not to be eliminated. And then you have to save those people. We might need our point back from you guys tonight, I think. I think we should secure another point. We're not going to be able to. And we're safe anyway. Like, we don't want to be Dr. Honest and greedy. We're safe. We're not, we're not going into elimination tomorrow. So why get an extra point? And people are like, why did you need that point? And we'll be like Jonathan, like, for what? To yeah, just show okay. what? You know? Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel mm -hmm. like the most important thing is who's going to be loyal to us next time round. Uh, yeah. So we have... We can do that. One so we have, a, we have one. So that means right now... But I think you should get Maurice to give you his point because he's not... Um, he's, yeah, there's no yeah. way he's going to stay in anyway, so... We are trying to accumulate points from yeah. as many teams the, as possible. Team Maurice also owes us one based on last challenge. Guys, so we're going to give you guys a point, okay? But we need your point back. Guys, I think it's talking My about. focus is on fighting yet again to, to get, not get, get eliminated. eliminated. Stay in the game, stay in the game. We're gonna count elimination. So all we need is that one point from you guys. I've got loyalty to people who have given me votes. So right now I'm sitting with loyalty. I owe people votes. Whoever needs me the most tonight, I'm thinking we'll go with them. Yes. Just to be fair and get, it get out that of the out. Way. And yeah. Jonathan also owes us a point, but it's gonna be interesting to see if he will actually give it to us. You too can win big with Tropica. Buy a Tropica promo pack, follow the details, enter, and stand a chance to win your share of thousands of smooth prizes, such as airtime, data, AEG fridges, Island Tribe hampers, rest assured beds, Barcelos vouchers, plus limited edition Tropica bags, towels, tents, cooler bags and cushions from Mr. Price Home. The more Tropica you buy, the more chances you stand to win. Tropica, nothing smoother.
The mood is definitely not as tense as the last time. I think it's because we didn't ask anyone for points this time. Our long our strategy is to get to minimum two points, um, so we know from Maurice we'll get a point. We don't trust anybody. It's we just can't a system trust like that. Yeah. Welcome to the Tropica Long Life Ceremony. It's been a long and eventful day, so let's have a look at the leaderboard. Sitting at the top, we have Team Roxy on 10 points. We have Team Jonathan on eight points. Team Sashi on seven points. Tied with six points, we have Team Ney, Team Brendan, and Team Astria. We have Team Colleen with five points. And finally, Team Maurice with two points. Roxy sitting at the top of the leaderboard. How do you think tonight's gonna pan out? I guess with the point giving, it's gonna be quite interesting to see where everyone ends up. Um, I'm guessing there's gonna be a tiebreaker for the elimination round, um, but you never know with all the twists and turns in the game. There is one more elimination. Only seven duos will be earning their Tropica flavor. At the end of the ceremony, the bottom four teams will be heading to elimination which means the top four teams will earn their trip to the Seychelles. In between you is a box with eight blocks inside representing each duo. On my call, you will select the block with the team you would like to gift point to. Without revealing it, place it face down at the front of your box. You may now select your blocks. Wow, that was quick. <laughs> Before you reveal your points, we still have one more matter to sort out. No one went for the long life charm. Would you like to know what it was? Yes. <laughs> it's about to go down. <laughs> it says a lot about your character if you just leave your, your squad stranded. Yeah, and the spoon was too heavy. We all needed each other. <laughs> Congratulations, you have won a long life charm. At the next long life ceremony, any points gifted to your team will be doubled. <laughs> or you can choose to double the gifted points of another team. Once the points are decided, but before the points are revealed, Anga will ask you whether you're playing the advantage for yourself or for another team. You must then decide whose points you will double. Good luck with the smooth talk. Had anyone gone for the long life charm, you would have secured your trip to the Seychelles. Can we have it now? <laughs> If you betray your squad and you go for the long life charm, then where are you going to get points to double? Ney, do you wish you'd gone for the long life charm? I think it was the best thing for us to stick to the vision that we had as a team. It was the best thing that we could do. Aww. <laughs> right. It's time to reveal your points. I don't know how it's going to play out. Um, we don't expect any points. I know we were sitting well, so let's see what happens. We chose our team. We want to see in the Seychelles. This is going to Team Nate. The same goes for us, sticking to the vision of teamwork and who we want to see in the Seychelles, Team Sashi. Team Jonna? I can only talk, because I always talk. So, I can talk. We are giving our, our point to Team Sharia. And we owe them. And we owe them. <laughs> We're literally the only ones really who have kind of offered to yeah, come and offered to help us. Yeah. Everyone else has kind of gone away and yep. take out the strong guys type of thing. So, Team Brendan? So we're going to give our point to Team Nay? No. Yeah. Ah. Just as we thought. Each hand there is an alliance. Team Carlin. So we decided to give our point to this team because we are hoping for all of you to go to the Seychelles. <laughs> <laughs> so our point is going to Team Brendan. 
Ja, danke Karlin. We uh, definitely needed that one. Team Ney. Um, we decided to give out vote to the Brada. Thank you, Bambra. Team Brandon. Thank you, Ney. Thank you so much for sticking to our agreement. <laughs> we decided to give our point to Team Surya. Team Surya? We decided to give our point to Team Jonathan. Team Jonathan. Tiebreaker. <laughs> <laughs> Let's recap the leaderboard. Still on top of the leaderboard is Team Roxy on 10 points. Still in second, Team Jono, at this time with nine points. Then we have a four-way tie between Team Sashi, Team Ney, Team Brendan, and Team Sria. Then we have Team Karlin on five points, and finally Team Maurice on two points. There's a four-way tie, meaning there'll be a tiebreaker challenge. Ah. Uh. Another tiebreaker. <laughs> we always in these tiebreakers. Tie in this bag are four Tropica bottles. Two peach and two <laughs> orange. <laughs> <laughs> that random. <laughs> Each team will select a flavor. The two teams that select the same flavor will go head to head. Here's how the game works. Only one team member from each duo will be able to do this challenge. Will the team leaders please come select a flavor? We'll start with Team Ne. Orange. Yeah. Team Brendan. Peach. Next up, Team Shreya. What flavor is it? Peach. Peach. And that means, Team Sashi, we have orange. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> the irony. So this means, Team Ney will be going up against Team Sashi. Team Shreya, you'll be going up against Team Brendan. Let's set up the game. And this challenge decides our fates if whether or not we're going to be in elimination. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Here's how the game works. There are two poles with a ball suspended between them. You will hold it up for 20 seconds, after which you will have 10 seconds to add a block on either side of the ball. You will hold it up for another 20 seconds. After that, you will add a second block on either side of the ball. You will hold it up for another 20 seconds, and then a third block on either side of the ball. Here's where it gets tricky. After that, it's all about endurance and focus. The first team in each round to drop the ball loses the challenge and will be heading to elimination. Guys, please note that only one member per duo may take part in the challenge. You ready to play? Yeah. Let's do this. <laughs> All right, guys, you have 10 seconds to prepare. Three, two, one. Already, Ney is shaking. Oh, almost dropped it. My chances of beating Ney are very high, um, <laughs> if I'm speaking honestly. But, um, but we don't want him to go home no, either, don't. so it's really, it's, we yeah. don't know what to do. Time. Three, two, one. Tane almost dropping it there. Mm, close, all right. It is the most nerve-wracking thing. I'm looking, then my eyes are closed, then I'm looking. Then I'm half <laughs> not breathing. And time. 
You got this, just don't be psyched out. Don't listen to anyone but me. And three, two, one. Got the shivers of it, huh? Yeah, I see so. <laughs> three, two, one. Oh, it's too long, eh? Oh, okay, so we're still gonna end. The pressure, you can feel the pressure. At the same time, I'm trying to focus, and these sticks are just trying to get the best of you. <laughs> so, I'm trying, I'm trying. And with three blocks on either side of the ball, you have five. Four, three, two, one. Yes, focus on that ball, Tan. You've got this. Now it's a matter of focus and endurance. Breathe in and out. <sighs> it was a bittersweet victory. Yeah, but I'm happy we're going to the Seychelles. Mm -hmm. So, mm, let's go. Yet again, it's not a nice feeling to be in another elimination challenge. And that means Team Ney will be joining the other two teams in the elimination challenge. Up next, we have Team Shreya and Team Brendan going head to head. Let us know who you think will take this one using hashtag Tropica. I'm just gonna get all of my focus in this challenge and uh, just cut off from everything around me. Going up against Brendan doesn't really make me nervous. Um, it's not a physical challenge in that sense, it's a more mental one. Brendan, the artist, you ready? Ready. Cool. You have 10 seconds to get ready. In five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Sitting there, I'm, I'm, I'm not panicking. I'm just keeping my cool. I'm telling him, just keep steady, keep steady, <laughs> keep steady. Three, two, one. Three. Two, one. The tension is high. I can see Liardes is also solid as a rock. Three, two, one. Big shake from Liardes. Brendan, solid as a rock. Three, two, one. Add a third block. Okay, but I think Brendan will have it. Three, two, one. Now it's all about endurance and focus. This is for a trip to the Seychelles. Brendan still looking solid as a rock. The artist a little shaky. Oh. Oh. Brendan. Almost dropping the ball there. Both guys looking solid. Liardos drops the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly yeah. what I wanted because mm. I want to face them straight on mm. because clearly they see us as a threat mm. and we need to take them out. Mm. But I'm feel for Liardis. I mean, now they need to go into elimination, which is not nice. Mm. But yo, at least we safe for now. Tim Brendan, well done. You're going to the session. Yes. 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 <laughs> and with that, 
we have our four competing in the next elimination challenge. To the rest of you, you can kick back and chill. Because you've earned your spot on the island. <laughs> yeah. Well done, guys. We did it. We did it. That was, that that was, was our my goal. goal. That yeah, was yeah. my main and goal. And she's never been to Seychelles. Yeah, so that's going to so. be my first time. Very yeah. happy. Awesome. Whatever's coming next, we're here for one reason. Mm. To challenge and to pull through. Definitely. Who do you think will make the cut? Let us know using hashtag Tropica and visit at MyTropica to take part in our weekly at-home challenges. Until next week, stay smooth, South Africa. Join us again as our all-stars compete for the show's biggest prize to date. And Play.Coza will be rewarding the runners-up with a mega mystery prize. Tune in to find out. Ten seasons of celebrating the smooth life. Tropica, nothing smooth. Another feel-good production.